Hey guys, it's Extreme Strategy here, and we are back today with Warhammer 2, and we are going to be doing the uh, Prince Sigvald campaign if it loads. There we go. Only 13 seconds. Good timing. And the last time we uh, killed the one massive mega army. We still, however, do have this smaller army in here. I don't believe that they can reach us. No, they cannot. However, we also have an army coming from this flank as well. Of the uh, Kislev faction. Absolutely not. So we got Prague and Kislev. Hellpit should slowly start liking us. Oh. Hellpit kind of is neutral towards us. So we're with Krakadrak. They could summon an army to go attack Frozen Landing. I would like to believe that that would never happen. But I can't guarantee it. Unfortunately. So for the time being... Uh, what does our forces look like? Yeah, they're still healing. So for the time being, we're going to uh, pop over here. And then we're going to pop back into encamp camp stance. How much money do I have? Uh, Fallen Knights of Chaos would be fun. However, I might just wait. So you figure I can then get... Now that I'm tier 4, I can actually get the, uh... Slaneshian building. I start getting Slaneshian units, because I have uh, discounts on Slaneshian units. And we can have our army of absolute death beasts of Slanesh. Then eventually we're going to want an army for corn and one for Zeech and everything else. Join war against these people? I am sorry, I have too many wars to deal with. Oh, you fled. You fled. You coward. Yeah, I don't care about them. Because I think they're with me, most likely. Ready! Now, I'd like to destroy this random Kislev army. And swing down and destroy Kislev. However, Prague is the more pressing force. It's gonna also have an army of... Ah! I do not like this. Not at all. Oh, I need six. I need, uh, six... My adoring points. Whoops. Alright, I can't reach you, however, I can attack Prague with an... 9 and no. 8, so that's 17. I'm saying it's 16. I might just stay in camp stance. Do I really need anything from in here? Nope. Alright, who's stronger? Whoops. Uh, so leadership is saying this one actually has armor. And shielded. Soon we have the Slanashian one, so I'm not too worried about it. I'm just gonna heal. I don't quite trust Volksgrad to hold off uh, two potential armies, and Reichland keeps confederating. And I'm never gonna be able to kill Reichland at this point. What? Come on, game, really? Alright, go attack this dude over here. What is up with all these fear- They have- WHAT?! No, this, this has to be a glitch. This has to be a glitch. Four cannons. Two thunderers, a great sword, long beards. What? This has to be too many mods implemented. I guess if, even if it isn't, I can just pelt the cannons to death with throwing spears. I uh, do have magic, and they do not, which is good. It's good to have magic. They need more magic.
I'm not going to gamble that because that's 11, so that's fairly good. Of course, you put your cannons on two sides. However, you did put your lord on that side. So what is the main concern here? Thunders are in the center. And gunners on the sides. This is actually good, but they have cav there. So group one's job is going to just be to tear those cannons apart. Group two's job is going to be to tear, tear, tear the cannons apart. You guys, prep to tear. Do not fail me. Prep. Oh, you have your uh, pendant of slanash. That's right. Oh, you do have perfect vigor. Is that from this? Might be. I, have a, I was looking for that previously. It showed him as being exhausted. However, unfortunately, some of my guys are still a bit wounded. Look you up there. Alright, start that. One. Kill. Two. Please kill. You. Kill these guys. Behind. Shoot them, shoot them. Thunders are already losing so much. Chaos sorcerer. Oh my goodness. Oh gosh, why this doesn't have enough reach, crud. That would have been like perfect. Just be absolutely despoiled. perfect. Blood. Quickly just blitz the thunders. Which then we have no other option. Oh, reach for crying out loud. Just like, just pop this bell. Don't have time. Attack the pop the spell. Now they got away. But, Fight these long beards. I don't want to see any survivors. Get him. Close. Alright, there's one. Help absolute bejeebies out of their lord. Where can, what can my cannons shoot? My cannons can shoot their cannons. Yeah. That'll work. So if you have perfect vigor, how are you tired? I, I very much want to know the answer to that question. Oh crud. Stop, game. Oh. I'll pluck your soul from your bones. Crud. I think I just hit my own guys. Get these guys in the far back, please. Thank you. I want them dead. They must feel the wrath of chaos. Actually, have your cans. You do. Oh, really? Oh, you're shattered. Actually, right. kill these thunders, please. Kill 
kill as many men as you can. Alright. Boys? Can we outrun them? Oh, yeah. You can definitely outrun them. Get those cannons pinned down. You have a speed of 28, and they have a speed of 28. So they shouldn't get away. You have 44, and he has 34. They have 28. Um, yeah, just kill the Lord. Actually, I've changed my mind. You guys need to go kill them. Fast forwards. Alright, kill the next batch of cannons. Enemy Lord is dead. Good. Come on, kill that, that batch of cannons. No survivors. Oh, they are unfortunately near the end of the level. Alright. That's fine. We ended their lord's life. We ended two cannons. We killed off quite a few other troops. I killed off several of mine, but who cares? I can just heal, fall back to allied territory. Seriously, though, I wish I was not at war with all of the, uh, tribes of, or not the tribes of, the Empire and Kislev, because then I could go, you know, actually unite Norska. However, I do want to kill Kislev before they start getting those nuclear cannons, because I do not have a counter to that. Other than all Vanguard deployment army that makes them shoot themselves and destroy themselves... And the Vanguard deployments in front of units in front of them, while the ones on the side would like hit their flanks. So that is my only counter. Okay. How much are you gonna run, dude? I hate you. Now we're just gonna auto resolve. We're just gonna auto resolve. The Sacrifice gods more captives. Me. Who are these right, we'll Put you in the stance to heal, because boy oh boy are you gonna need it. Alright, you have a skill point. I like to put that in the bolts of change. You, however, have a skill point as well. That's favorite song. That's an increase to melee attack. For this Lanesh. Or recruitment capacity. That could be fun. Um. Yeah, look at this. It's going to be a little bit before we do start getting that, however. Finest excess, at least to give my troops a little bit of experience. But I do not think Kislev is coming my way anytime soon. I also got to fight the Empire, and they have a couple nuclear weapons as well. Yeah, because they have steam tanks. And I have the nuclear steam tanks. What are my forces? It's a Chaos Lord with a bunch of Forsaken, Gore Beasts, Hell Cannons. Uh, we're gonna wait until I have a better army. Witness my beauty. That's all there is to it. 
Yeah, I could take out the Fort Ostorsk. However, like I said, I would very much like to start uniting this area, so I might just head to the farthest reaches of the Norskin lands and start taking over that territory for me. A beautiful decision. And have Let that be more of the plan. Yeah, because like you have those two armies right there, and Shall we decant the wine? yeah, I'm not gonna do that just yet. I actually have to make it through, you know, <laughs> these guys' territory. Now I gotta decide which of the Norsekin tribes I will ally with, and whom I must destroy. Really, I'm not attacking you. Now go away. These guys could crush me. Diplomacy, rot blood tribe. Hello, my friend. Military alliance, so that's good. So what are your two settlements, my friend? Of spawns. Oh, and then you have Brass Keep, which currently has a plague. You're not at war with any of the Norskins, are you? No. Uh, I'm thinking Scaling was wasn't Scaling the one I was gonna know. I'm the Norklings. Might have been, though. To be honest, I'd rather be raided. Varg. But... Are you a god? I guess it all depends on what I see. The Dark Prince wishes. All right. All right, rib spreader, go spread some ribs. I'm gonna go uh, try and unite Norse guy. No, we are not going to war with Sylvania. No, no, no. Sort of Cain claimed. Alright, thankfully that is far enough away that I'm not too concerned. Except you hate these guys. Oh, that could be fun. Hmm. Alright, where is my Slaneshian building? Really? Here it is. Alright, the Harem of Slanesh. Easy. Increase magic resistance. Now we're going to want to increase bolts of change ability. And turn. See what we can do. Blood Tribe is not declaring war on the Winter Pyre. However, Karakadrak Kara has an 18 stack with an 8 stack garrison. You know what? We're taking back this round of city. Ready. We're taking this back. Oh, this might actually be a fight. Shall we decant the wine? Alright, uh, Slanesh, what do you have? Some good warriors of Slanesh. Lancers, warriors have... Same speed as the Lancers. How these guys are anti-large and armor-piercing. But they do cost quite a bit more. Might take like two lancers. 
Like I said, eventually I want to be able to field a second army. Well, once again, I want to also be able to, you know, control all of Morska. Or growth plus five. Perfect. Let us go attack with our brand new army. It's a Furic victory. Why? This is ridiculous. Also, eventually, gonna have to get rid of this port cannon and replace it. We're the horsemen eventually. We have quite a few things to uh, redo. We're gonna take back Jacques. This thing. That, that city. Oh, yeah. That's. That is good in Winds of Magic. Very good Winds of Magic. I want to see what they have if I move my troops forwards. Am I allowed to see? No, I am not. Well, that stinks. I was hoping. Chaos Warriors on either side. Come on up. My lancers, you are foot soldiers. 31 speed. Compared to what I've been working with, 28. So you guys are a little bit faster. I did not realize you guys were 39 speed. However, you're still weak as all get out. Kill, two, slide, three, charge, four, third flank, six, move it. Oh my goodness, that is a lot of archers. Okay, that is a lot of archers. We have Kvass and Navix. We have special ranged weapons, that's just what I wanted to see. That my units have specialized ranged weapons. Probably intending to kill me. Alright, shoot that guy. I know just how powerful these bolts change are. If they hit. Close you have to be. Alright, now double on back. Get into their back lines and just harass them. Thank you. Let's head this way. Alright, this is a lot of ranged units. Chaos, why couldn't you have better ranged? Yes. Destroy them. I need the Zichun units for range, though, unfortunately. Which is a bit problematic. Alright, slide on up so you can support these guys. Group one, don't le let a single one of these ranged units live a second longer than they have to. All these guys are in perfect positions. 
prime position, and let me guess. You have to run forwards, reveal your plans, and then you can cast your spell. Well, you had to run forwards and reveal your plan, but you did at least get the spell off. Go into melee. Begin the reaping. Go into melee. Chaos comes. So you guys start killing these units. Keep up the fire. Keep up the fire, keep up the pressure. That's what you gotta do. For chaos! Fight men! Fight for our right Corns, bloody glory! Kill! Maim! Burn! Alright, Lancers and Slanash are trash. Alrighty, that's good to know. Oh my goodness. Okay, where are the rest of these units? Okay, they are being chased by it. Don't lose cover sacks. Leave. Alive. I'm so many units to this. Why are you chasing them? Get your butt back here. Snipe them. And you missed. I am the gods. They will succumb. Kill these clavicides. Actually, kill these guys. Where are you, Sig? Bald, get over here. Keep popping the pendant of Slanesh. Kill these guys. And keep up the pressure. For the Chaos Gods! I do not want any of these guys being able to come back. Boys, stay in the fray. Yeah, kill those cap sacks. Don't let them live. Don't let the Lord live. Seen quite a bit of yeah, shattering. Thank goodness. Alright, first things first. Cheers. Quickly. Swap to melee. Just kill the chick assist. Check assist. Check assist. Whatever it is. Swap to melee. Kill the warriors. Chaos sorcerer. Shoot. Yes, kill them. No, actually, can you hit these guys? Doesn't look like it. Alright, kill him then. These guys have a speed of 31. You have a speed of 44, and I can increase that. Now I do a speed of 54. Kill them all! Alright, can you guys kill these archers real quick? Um... 
I guess the answer is yes, we're going to kill a bunch of archers today. Come on. There we go. Have to remove some of those units permanently. And once again, I forget that that was a settlement battle, and I did not have to do that. Really? When will my brain wake up? These Lancers are not very good. Oh, Slanesh is more of a glass cannon, I guess. I've always imagined that would be more of the demonettes and whatnot, not necessarily the Lancers. But I guess in Warhammer 3, they will definitely be a glass cannon. And I am probably going to love it. Yeah, I know I'm not doing too hot with these right now, but that should change. Once I actually take a look at everyone's stats. Sometimes I kind of forget about them, about the fact that they are not the greatest. However, everyone is ranking up quite nicely. It's going to be really bad, sad when I have to get rid of those uh, horse archers, but that point is coming. Or horse spearmen. Give to the hordes. Alright, so we're gonna replenish. Shall we decant the wine? Just Ready. Man. We're gonna toss in some of that. We're gonna disband you. Are you a god? We're going to merge. There we go. And this army no, I will not share does my plan. Ooh. Witness my beauty. We're right on the edge of them being able to attack, but I would not. Um, I wouldn't think they would. I won't think they will. Get. Oh, actually, no. Yes, we want that. Heteronatic pleasure. We build something different, please. No, we cannot. Um. What all do we need? We could start getting these. Or we could keep along the blue tree. Now let's get some upkeep production. We're gonna need it. Then we need to head back on out. My only concern here is crack, crack a drag, but eventually. Eventually, they will be defeated. Tribesmen gather. You're building up an army. The tribes gather. I'd love to say that these guys are building up armies, but I just don't see it. I mean, even these guys over here, my allies over here, aren't doing too good. Come on, boys, really? I am Slanesh's son. Onward to destruct. Be gone. Don't think so. Right, so they can definitely not reach me when I go around this passage. Trying to get over here to do some damage. Dominance. 
Bring my so we're gonna over here. Let's see if I can draw you out. Also, we gotta figure out who all is down here and powerful. Who will my ally be? Any of this give? Uh, I can actually get. Ar yes, I would like some arcane scripture. Scripture will be most appreciated. That's technically though, but I could technically I can go anywhere and gift whatever settlements I want to the Norskin Horde. The, it's the fact that they're so much weaker than I am. I want to go and beat up on someone. I wouldn't imagine it would be the uh, Rot Blood Tribe. Because they are of Nurgle, and I want to keep them around. Keep on heading on down. Sometimes we gotta keep replenishing. One of my troops to be prepared for the next attack. You see, Reichland just keeps on confederating. You come before me as a penitent. This tickles me. I may be merciful and not torture you for a thing. How are you at war against the Latland? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that, uh, Zlatlan... Yeah, is all the way in Lustria. Display. Are you guys at war? No, you're not. Galen could be a good ally. You can talk at me, mortal, but that will not or they might not be willing to. Yes, I am told you want to talk. Really, you're gonna you're gonna be mad at me? All right, fine. How many cellmates do you have? Two. Yeah. For chaos. Um, I have an easy solution for you. Declare war on you. Moving. Gift to the Horde. Oh my goodness, that just helped out our income so much. That was pretty impressive. Except I forgot to get go into my uh, encampment stance. Where are you from? May I ask, good sir? Uh, Nurgle or Slanesh? Nurgle. Spoilers come. Actually, no. Never stop. We're going to stop right here. We're going to attack them next time. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like button, subscribe, check out the Discord channel. It's growing very steadily. I'm very pleased with how it's growing. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video and hope you enjoy the rest of your day.